Thank you, Madam Chair. I'm Elaine C from Climate Action Network. Responding to the climate crisis requires decisive action across all sectors. But the Substar Report's presentations demonstrate that IQO and IMO are failing to address the significant impacts of aviation and shipping. 18 years after Kyoto, these emissions are growing at rate twice that of other sectors. The Paris Agreement must send a clear signal that IQO and IMO must make a fair contribution to limiting temperature increase to 1.5 degrees. On agriculture, Karen appreciates parties' positive engagement in Paris. Parties should eva evaluate methodologies to ensure on-the-ground results while including considerations and safeguards to protect and promote food security, biodiversity, equitable access to resources, the right to food animal welfare, and the rights of indigenous people and local populations while promoting poverty reductions and adaptation. Ongoing efforts to ensure sufficient finance for adaptation and for a global goal on adaptation should also be supported. We request SABSA to help identify options to enhance food security to protect the livelihood of small-scale farmers at next year's workshop. Thank you. Thank you very much for your statements.